you are gonna love this house. This kind of a townhouse does not come on the market very often in Idaho Falls. This amazing property here on Torrey Pines is in the Brookside subdivision. And I'll tell you, location, location, and you are not gonna wanna miss a minute of the inside of this house because it is a true, unbelievable luxury property here in Idaho Falls. Let's start out with your location right here first. We are on Brookside, um, which is just south of Sunnyside on 49th South. Now what that means is you're right outside, right, you're right at the edge of the city limits, but you are a zip zoo right on into town. Like you're probably two minutes from the hospitals right here, which means also the movies, the restaurants, the malls all out here in Ammon and on the east side of town. If you look up and down this street, this is a unique little subdivision. It is not full of a whole bunch of townhomes. There's only about 10 townhomes in this little subdivision inside a luxury um, subdivision. And it's, this is on the end of the road on the cul-de-sac. There's a beautiful green retention um, water area on the side. So a really nice place for um, if you have a dog or a park or those kind of things, but there's no through streets. So you get no traffic through this subdivision. It is so amazing. What you're gonna notice first from the outside, of course, is unbelievable. This was built in 2005. So you see this beautiful, beautiful, mature, mature landscaping, gorgeous flowers. Now I'll tell you right now, do not miss seeing this backyard because the canal that runs back through and the fire pit and the flowers, oh, it's amazing. So you get a beautiful two car garage. This um, townhouse is actually 36 100 square feet, fully finished basement, four bedroom, three bathroom, and these floors are gorgeous. Let's go in and take a look, because I've been hyping it up, but you gotta see inside. If there's one word to describe this house, it's light. When you walk in and you see this main floor living, it just opens up to the east with just light, light, light. So let's take a quick peek over this way. You've got yourself a bedroom and or an office. It's got the French doors, opens up to the west side, but a really big, really big room with a big closet. You've got a main level bathroom with a tiled tub and shower, and of course, a coat closet here. And you can just check out the size and the space in these rooms. The doors are big, the walkways are big. It's just space, space, space. Let's take a look over here. You're gonna notice all of the light wood. So you have that beautiful wood feel, but all the light coloring. The floors are gorgeous. The vaulted ceilings with your skylights. And some of my favorite things in this house are these amazing Tiffany chandeliers. They are so fun and they bring such a soft glow in the evenings that really sets a really nice mood. All of the cabinets have recessed lighting. So if you wanna kind of turn down the light and have a glow, this house glows. It's amazing. Here's our living area. Now you're gonna see a lot of the furnishings. Most of these furnishings can be purchased with the house. Um, they're negotiable in the, um, with the price. So if you see something you like, take a look to let us know. What I love about the big windows along here is they've chosen the shades that let the light in but keep the privacy. You've got yourself a gas fireplace, which is one of three fireplaces in this home. Tons of space. It works over into a formal living area, which is always nice to have that looks out to the east. The table is huge, so you can see how much space is in this area. It opens up to this unbelievable kitchen. Now, what I do like to point out is if you take a look, I'm gonna have you take a look back at the beginning again. This blocks, this little island or this little partition blocks people from when they walk in seeing right into the kitchen, but it keeps the space open. So you've got this great little kind of um, side cabinet here. If you were doing a buffet, lots of cabinet space. You've got your gas cooktop plus more counter space all the way around. We've got a dishwasher here and you've got what I love. You have double ovens plus your microwave and a giant pantry here in the corner. Again, a little more space and a huge refrigerator. There is just so much space. When you have 3,600 square feet in a townhome, it's just big and wide and so comfortable and just so bright. So as we continue on this way, again, we have main floor living. So everything's on the main floor, plus your additional full, fully finished downstairs basement. You've got yourself a closet, a utility closet here. And then take, out, take a look at this huge mudroom slash laundry room with a giant window, tons of cabinet space, and a sink. 
All right, let's go out and let's take a look at that double car oversized garage because now there is also something special in the garage. You're gonna notice super, of course, tall ceilings. I'm gonna point out here, this is where your central vac is located. So the house has central vac. You'll notice over on to the other side, you've got extra deep. He's got a workshop set up right now. So you've got tons of space in this oversized two bay. It's not just a two car, it's a two bay garage. Now what I wanna show you something is something really special. I'm gonna just open up this door because I'm gonna take you over here to see something. Also negotiable in this price is a full generator setup. Now let's, let's start outside and let's take a look. So you've got this big giant generator and all the hoses and plugs. So let's, take, let's talk about how this works. Come this way. If you have a power outage or something's going on, you've got yourself an RV plug right here. Now, if you take that generator and roll it on out, you could roll it right outside the man door. We've got a little pad right here ready for it to sit. You can take a hose that's included in the package and run the hose right down here for a specially situated quick access natural gas hose um, hookup right here. So you plug the special hose into the natural gas stub out. You run that hose to the generator that sits right here. Then you take this heavy duty electrical um, um, extension cord, plug it into your generator, run it this way, and here you have an RV plug, a 50 amp RV plug. You plug the generator right in here. Then we head inside. Once we're inside, you come into your panel right here and you'll see this special little generator um, switch. So you, bring, you flip this over and bring it down and now you can turn any, it brings all the power into the, um, into the uh, panel and you can flip on and off the things you need to power in your house. Now that generator is pretty big. It can power a lot of stuff, but you decide what you need to have on and what you don't need to have on. And that is the way the generator system works. Now it also can work where they have an adapter. If you have a smaller generator, if you wanted to have the smaller and just maybe run the furnace or just maybe run the refrigerator, if there's something, you don't have to get the big, big thing out. They have a power that you can just put the adapter in, plug it in. And this runs off propane, gas, like petroleum gas or the natural gas. So all of those are run that you can use with this package, which is super awesome. So this house is ready. Let's go in and take a look at some more features. What we haven't looked at yet is the master suite. Let's go take a look. This is the giant master suite. Again, on the main floor, super amount of space. You've got the beautiful window with the, the windows with a transom window and just tons of space. So as you're gonna notice, you've got a fireplace, that's fireplace number two, and it's a see-through fireplace that goes through so that if you need a little ambiance for that bathtub. We come on in and you're gonna see that we've got double sinks, beautiful, again, beautiful um, wood all throughout this house. And then as you come in, you're gonna see a giant swimming pool-like jetted tub. I think that's almost made for four. Huge tub with the see-through fireplace. You've got your separate glass shower. You've got your separated water closet toilet area and check out this giant walk-in closet. This is an awesome master suite. And you'll notice again, just lots and lots of space, lots and lots of space. Let's go and check out the fully finished basement. I just love this basement. I love the wood. I love the warmth the huge tall ceilings. This, this is a basement, but again, everyone that asks, what's the deal with the basements in Southeast Idaho? This is a non-basement basement because look at the size of those windows. Every room downstairs has these giant, giant windows. So tons of space downstairs. You're gonna love this giant closet. Goes all the way back in, lots of shelving. Let's check out the first bedroom this way. So this actually be your third bedroom in the house. So check out your third bedroom, tons of space, huge window. Now we're on to the third fireplace in this house. This gorgeous, beautiful wood with your hidden wires behind the cabinetry, gas fireplace, matching built-in shelves. Now I mentioned that there's a second living area downstairs. So if you were to have someone that needed that lived with you and what they wanted to have their separate area, this double door closes off and you can create your own space 
inside of this room. So I'll have you check out first the little kitchenette that they've built to utilize this space as a second living area. We've got the third bathroom, full bathroom down here in the basement, a giant living room, um, a giant bedroom. So this has plenty of space. Again, the giant, giant windows, huge closet. There's, if you are using this as a second living area, there's plenty of space in here for extra furniture and a giant bed. Let's check out the utility room. As you come in, you've got two giant water heaters. You've got a full Culligan water softener system, and then the furnace and AC are new. I didn't mention we were outside. The roof is also five years old. Everything is new and upgraded. It's amazing in this house. Let's check out that final bedroom. Again, if you were using this for a secondary living space, this might be maybe the living room area. This is an extra big bedroom. So you've got kind of an entry space here, a sitting area, and then it opens up to this big bedroom with a giant west facing window. And there are actually two closets in this bedroom. The first one is huge. It goes all the way back in there, as well as having a second closet right here that's all the way under the stairs. So much space. Let's go out and check out that backyard. You're getting one more look across at this open area. Again, check out that partition. It just makes it so nice not to see right into the kitchen, but you don't lose that open floor plan. As we come out into the backyard, you're gonna step down on this giant patio. So we're on the east side of the house. So there is evening shadow once it gets onto the other side in the summer. So this is all nice and shaded. You have a gas stub out if you wanna have a gas barbecue. Again, this furniture could be included, it's negotiable. But look at the gardens. You've got strawberries, tomatoes, beans, squash. This is a beautiful garden backyard. And let's go down and take out my favorite part. Take a look at my favorite part. This beautiful arbor with squash and the Black Eyed Susans, and they've got a little fire pit built out here. So you can watch on this gorgeous canal. Now the sellers say what some of their favorite things about this location is that you've got this gorgeous canal and the ducks bring their little ducklings right up in and you see them in the morning and you hear them quacking and you have this kind of unique experience with all of the birds and the animals here in this location. But check out this gorgeous canal that separates you and gives you lots of privacy and plenty of space in your backyard. Or I might even say your backyard oasis. This townhome is a must see. You are not gonna want to miss out on seeing this gorgeous luxury home in the Brookside subdivision. Come check it out. Call me if you'd like a private tour. And if you're watching this video, so are hundreds of buyers. Call me to list your home today. I'm Jessica Carden, your nosy neighbor. If you'd like to know the value of your home, go to the site below or call me today.